A two milliwatt beacon transmitter using a JCAR 433 MHz module supported by this Haverford 9 meter squid pole. What sort of distance can I get? Keep watching and you'll find out. As you can probably tell, I'm now on a bike ride, just doing a range test with the transmitter about 10 metres above the ground. As you can hear, beacon's still audible.
as you can hear it's chopping in and out a bit. Now the receiver isn't very high up, about a metre off the ground. I'll just lift it higher and it's a bit better. We're going a little bit higher here. Now here, it's almost dropped out, but it is at quite a low height. Now there's another signal, further away I get from my transmission, the more there'll be other things like garage door openers, a lot of low power things operate around this frequency. Now going up slightly, so maybe it will come back. And seems like we've lost it. What about the mute? Oh, I heard a little bit just there. Yeah, it's not quite breaking the mute, but it is there. and came back, there it is, back again.
and this is a look towards the path towards my place where the beacon is at there we are that's a test with a bell thing handheld as a receiver just using the standard rubber ducky antenna and a two milliwatt beacon on the end of a nine meter pole you'd definitely get better range if I gave both ends a better antenna and also if they were a bit more line of sight as well when I go QRP portable, I leave a lot of stuff at home. But there's one thing I always take, and that's my Haverford squid pole. Available in lengths from three to 10 meters, they're ideal for portable amateur radio, shortwave listening, and CB. For more information, visit haverford.com.au. That's haverford.com.au. And in an exclusive offer for VK3YE viewers, put in VK3YE as the discount code for polls delivered within Australia. Haverford.com.au. Browse their range today and see if any appeal. Well that's it for the end of this video. I'll do an EEV blog and give you a bit of a bike ride, a look around the neighbourhood. <laughs>